Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Hill. So you only have two weeks left of digital learning before summer. I know that a lot of you are super excited about that. I'm super sad that we had to end this year on a digital note, but at least we still um, got to do um, some learning digitally. Um, I'm going to go ahead and talk to you guys really quickly about um, the assignment that I'm giving you for this week. Um, it's going to be under the week seven digital learning assignments tab. Once you click that tab, view assignment, you're going to see these instructions. Week seven digital learning assignment. First thing I want you to do is go to wonderlopolis.org by clicking the link below. Here's the link. When you click it, wonderopolis.org will appear. Okay. And you can get on this website and search for any question you might have, like what would the earth be like with no moon? Or what is the singularity? Or what is the most difficult instrument to play? Okay. So I think I'm going to go with what's the most difficult instrument to play. You'll click on a question that you might want to research and go ahead and uh, read the passages. You can listen to it or read it. So today's wonder of the day was inspired by Mia. Mia wonders, what's the hardest instrument to play? Thanks for wondering with this, Mia. And you'll read the passage that talks about what's the most difficult instrument to play or whatever topic you chose to research. Okay. Once you read over the topic, you're going to go back to your assignment and answer some research questions. First of all, what's your first and last name? Make sure you put that. What class period do you have, Mrs. Hill or Miss Lackey? Not for RTI. What topic did you decide to research on wonderopolis.org? Did you decide to research about the moon? Did you decide to research singularity? Maybe what's the most difficult instrument to play, like what I researched? But you can pretty much search for anything. You can explore wonders here and find different things that maybe other people have um, searched for and researched. So just go through here and find anything that you want to read about. Come back. Tell me what topic you wanted to research. Next question. What is something you already knew about the topic before beginning your research? Well, I already knew a whole lot about um, different instruments, but maybe there's something new that I learned from that passage. Okay, so I want you to choose a passage and then tell me what is something that you learned from your research. Next, finish the sentence with your opinion. I was interested in this topic because, just tell me why you picked that topic. I picked the topic about musical instruments because Joel plays musical instruments, and I just wanted to see what instrument would be the hardest to learn. Next, what is, what's one thing that you discovered while researching your topic? What was one thing that you discovered while researching your topic? Next, what was another interesting thing you discovered while researching your topic? So I just want two interesting things that you discovered while researching your topic. Next, what would you like to research further about the topic? For me, I'm going to go back and maybe research more difficult instruments or maybe what's the easiest instrument for someone to learn to play. What questions do you still have after researching the topic? My question is, why is it so difficult? What's so hard about it? I want to I want to know more about what's difficult about instruments. And then what topic from wonderopolis.org did Mrs. Hill talk about on her video? I'm talking about musical instruments and the difficulty of playing musical instruments. But this is pretty much all that you'll be answering for this week. Not that hard, but each question is worth 10 points 
please be sure to use complete sentences. Um, I will take off credit if it's not written in a complete sentence. So that's the end of my video for this week. Um, I really hope that you guys have a great week. And if you have any questions, please reach out to me. Don't forget that on Mondays, I do um, Google Meets at 1030, but I'm available to do Google Meets anytime that you need me. Have a really great rest of the week. Bye.